Spanish 4, Beauty and Aesthetics, Vocab 26 through 30. 26. Lovely, agradable. I agree. She is able to be a lovely person. Get it? I agree. She is able to be a lovely person. 27. Design, diseño. Every time I ask to design it differently, they say no. Like, let's say you're an engineer and you're working on a project and you see that there are some design problems and you want to fix them. And you say, every time I ask to design it differently, they say, see the word say, no. So, diseño is design. And it's got three of the same letters in the same order, D-S-N. Flop is pinchazo. Let's pretend you had to make a presentation in class or in business and you really thought it was going to be a flop, okay? And it turned out really, really well. So halfway through the presentation, you say, wow, I feel like I ought to pinch myself. As I'm making this presentation, it's not a flop. It's going quite well. So you, you expected them not to like your idea and they love it. You say, wow, I feel like I should pinch myself like you're dreaming. As I'm making this presentation, it's not a flop, it's going pretty well. Pinchazo, flop. Melody or tune is melodia. <clears throat> now, remember, a lot of times if a word in English ends in Y, in Spanish it turns into IA with an accent. Mary turns into Maria. Day turns into dia. Melody turns into melodia. And again, these light green letters mean they're exactly the same, the same order in Spanish and English. So M-E-L-O-D, M-E-L-O-D, melody, melodia. The male painter is el pintor, and the female painter is la pintora. You've seen this before. If a word ends in R, a male word, you add an A, like profesor turns into profesora, senor turns into senora, doctor turns into doctora. And you know that uh, pintar is to paint. Remember we talked about I used a pint of paint to, on the project, so pintar is to paint, and el pintor is the male painter, and la pintora is the female painter. Let's take a post quiz. <clears throat> Let me cover up the Spanish, take a few moments, look at these words and phrases in English, and either say or write the Spanish equivalents to make sure you know them. This has been Spanish for Beauty and Aesthetics, vocab 26 through 30.